morning. I'm Alex Sloan, your authorized instructor in the golfing machine, and I'm going to make this tape for my favorite people in the world, the students of the golfing Katie, Katie machine. Balance, your first two essentials to good golf. The third essential to good golf is rhythm. One of the most misunderstood words, because every time you hear the word rhythm, we think in terms of music. Mr. Kelly's definition of rhythm is something different. His interpretation of rhythm is always keeping the left arm and club shaft in line, this way. This is what he means by rhythm. And so that as we're swinging, if we maintain rhythm this way, we can trace the plane line and do some other crucial things I'll talk about in just a moment. When we violate imperative number one, we lose rhythm. Imperative number one. There's four imperatives. We talk about three of them over and over and over, but there's a fourth one that I preach, preach, preach. The first imperative to good golf is a flat left wrist. When God created your hands and your body, he said, you can sin or you can do good. Okay. This is good. This is good. This is sinful. You never want to make that sin in God. That's what the majority of people do. Now, what causes that sin to happen is this pointing finger that we are in such a habit of pointing at people, you know, and making accusations. But this finger is the creator of sin in God. Where this club touches the finger, it's called the number three pressure point. So that as we're holding the club, we want to keep that pressure inert and light and sensitive. We want to develop educated hands so we can monitor what that finger is doing because this is controlling your club head. If I push with that finger, I have sinned. Look at the bent left wrist. This is not acceptable under any circumstance at any time on any golf shop. 